Hey y'all, uh, Anson here over at Ivy Forge. Alright, so let's do the, the maiden voyage uh, of this charcoal forge. Uh, we'll go ahead and light it off, even though it's not 100% done. Uh, I still want to light it off and uh, let's see how it goes. Alright, check it out. So even with the hair dryer on a lowest setting, uh, I mean, as you can see, I'm underneath the canopy and it will shoot up sparks. So I'm probably not going to be able to use uh, the canopy when I'm using this. Uh, but here's the maiden voyage and it works pretty good. It's it nice and hot. Yeah, I got a piece of uh, three quarter inch bar. So, I use my other pan to break up the bits. See, it's already got that bar to red heat. Less than a minute. There she goes. Uh, she, she's beautiful. She throws off a lot of sparks. Uh, I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to leave up that canopy uh, when I'm using it. But uh, yeah, I was hoping I could put it here in my shop. But with all the sparks that uh, charcoal throws off, I know coal doesn't do a lot of sparks like that. It does a little more smoke than it does sparks. Um, so if I'm going to put it in here, I'm going to have to do some type of vent hood uh, to stop all that, that sparks and, and smoke whatnot. Uh, but that's fine. I, I put it outside for now. 
uh, I'll just take down that canopy whenever I'm going to use it and make sure the kids aren't around. All right, so appreciate you checking this this build out, and I'm still going to do uh, a couple more videos on this, uh, just finishing it up, get it, getting it painted, getting the door put on. Um, I am going to also put another little uh, table top around the top of it, right, to be able to just hold some more charcoal in place that way I can use a, a rake uh, to bring it into the fire pot. And because I know I know charcoal, it, it burns up really quick. Okay, so I, I just have to keep feeding the fire. Um, I'm still going to try to do another type of gate as well, because uh, even on the low setting for this hair dryer, it just blows out a lot of air, uh, and I just want to be able to control that a little more. All right, so uh, if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. It'd be greatly appreciated. Leave any comments down below uh, if you know good or bad uh, what you've seen with this build thus far uh, check out some of these other videos um, that I got going of the forge build videos part one and two all right and then you can also subscribe uh, down the corner like I said if you haven't subscribed um, to my channel already all right and we'll catch you on the next one bye